welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Annie Petrova and I'm a freelance marketing consultant and a full-time mom based in London, UK. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through a day in my life. So if you're interested to know how I spend my days, make sure you stay with me till the end. I usually wake up around 7.30 in the morning when my daughter's waking up and I start my day like this with a cup of nice coffee. Lately I've been avoiding dairy, so I use this oat milk for my latte and actually Oatly is one of the best um, I've used so far, so I really recommend it if you like oat milk. You can see the foam it makes, it's just amazing. It's, it's really, really nice. I love it. And my coffee is ready. A moment to enjoy our view of the city and I'm ready to start my day. Next, I usually prepare breakfast and send my husband off to work. And while Vicky is having her breakfast, I have mine too and take the chance to catch up on social media. Once we're done with breakfast, it's time for a play session and um, if we don't go out, we usually read books, draw, paint, role play, sing and dance. I really try to do different things each day um, and keep her entertained, but um, yeah, today we're staying at home and we're going to draw on the aqua doodle mat. She's been loving it lately and it's one of her favorite activities so I really recommend it to um, all the mums out there who are watching this video because it's, um, yeah, it's very entertaining, um, it's also very educational, it helps them develop their uh, motor skills, um, yeah, and it's very interactive, you can draw with them, so yeah, it's a, it's a great activity. After the play session, it's already about lunchtime and Vicky's very tired, so um, yeah, she's having quickly lunch and then she's off to bed for her afternoon nap. At this time, the living room is usually a disaster, so I take the opportunity to quickly tidy up. Once I'm done with tidying up, now my working day can officially begin. I try to work only while my daughter's sleeping, but sometimes I have urgent tasks and calls and when I have to do that, um, I usually let her watch some TV. Otherwise, when she's awake, I try not to do any work and um, yeah, just try to spend quality time with her. I usually start my work session with checking my email and the latest news and then I move on to any urgent tasks I have and uh, client work which usually involve most of the time writing and uh, doing some research. At the moment I'm doing some freelance work for a couple of clients and my tasks differ from building marketing campaigns to writing copy, doing research and email communications, pretty much everything. I'm a generalist and work across the whole marketing mix, but mostly enjoy strategy, content and inbound marketing. And I'm also working on some side projects, um, but I'll tell you a bit more about that when I'm ready sometime in the future. When I'm not doing client work or working on any of my side projects, I might be shooting videos or doing any other marketing related work or 
working on my other hobbies. Um, I very much enjoy photography, so um, yeah, lately I've been working on developing my skills, photography skills. After almost four hours, around four o'clock, Vic usually wakes up. Then we go out, but because I'm going to an event tonight, now I'm gonna take a shower and get ready for the event. It's time for some makeup now. I usually don't spend much time on my makeup and during most of the time I don't really wear makeup. But today, because I'm going out, so uh, yeah, I'm just going to quickly prep. And here all the beauty gurus will probably patronize me for my application techniques but that's what I call express mommy's makeup in less than three minutes While I'm off to the Revolut's Rev Rally event tonight in Canary Wharf, if you haven't heard of Revolut, they're a fintech scale-up, they're not a startup anymore, and it's one of the challenger banks here in the UK, and so they've been growing very massively over the past few years. So yeah, they're really one of the fintech market leaders at the moment uh, here, and not only, even in Europe. So I'm very much looking forward to the event and um, I'll take you with me and I'm going to show you a sneak peek uh, to their offices and here we go.
event um, here in Canary Wharf and it's about 8.30 here in London and um, yeah it was a pretty great event they shared three of their latest um, offerings and products um, one is the uh, Revolut Youth which is an account for the generation Z or 17 and below years old and the other updates were about their donation accounts and boats and uh, their uh, commission free trading platform which um, yeah it was it was pretty informative very interesting to learn how they're planning to uh, approach the market and the strategies they've taken um, they didn't really go into much detail about the um, actual strategies but it was still quite a good event to you know if you want to just get introduced to the Revolut offering and get an update on what's happening with them and what they've been up to um, from a consumer perspective from a customer perspective it's quite good um, from you know from my perspective it was pretty vague but still I mean I think it was a great experience great event to um, you know especially if you want to um, meet up with uh, other Revolut um, customers and to just mingle and network it, it's a good good event and I recommend it um, and um, here is the I think this will be the end of my day so far I'm going home now and my daughter and my husband are at home and she's probably already in bed so usually at this time if I haven't finished anything I'll um, finish it now and I continue working until uh, about 12 1 2 in the morning yeah you heard it I don't sleep that much um, I only sleep about five six seven hours a day a night um, but it's fine I mean uh, that's my that's pretty much of my daily routine almost every day I mean I don't go to events that often um, today is an exception pretty much so yeah I hope you enjoyed the video and um, if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my future videos uh, please share in the comments if you have any ideas about any future content you want to see from me and I'll see you in my next video bye